Hello again and welcome to Ndudu by Fafa. Welcome to my creative world of African cooking, where you would find traditional and creative recipes. Now today on the menu, I do have something rather exciting. This is how to cook the perfect fluffy coconut rice. Here you have your list of ingredients for this amazing recipe. Now, if you've actually been following me or you've actually visited my blog in dudubaifafat.blogspot.com, you will know that I've actually got various recipes on how to cook your perfect rice. Um, I did make one actually on ITV, which was incredible. And um, through me reinventing things, I actually found a better way actually of making them the rice. The secret to your fluffier rice is to wash your rice of any excess starch and I prefer to actually use lukewarm water to wash the rice. So here I'm actually adding a cup of lukewarm water and I'm just going to rub it in between my fingers and palms and like just wash this rice till the water runs clear. To actually achieve the desired texture for the rice, you would need to repeat this process um, at least three times or at most four and that would actually get rid of all the excess starch. So you can see this is my second time and I think I did it the third time and it was fine. Um, now once the water runs clear, you're ready to start cooking. Once your water is actually run clear, discard the water and at this stage, put your kettle on to boil some water. What I'm actually going to do is actually pour the hot boiling water into the rice. Now this is going to partially cook the rice and also would allow the shape of the rice to form perfectly. Stir this and leave it for about five minutes. And during that stage, place your saucepan on a medium heat and add your coconut oil. Now melt your coconut oil for about a minute and then add your quartered um, onion. Add your chilies and fry this gently for about three minutes on a very low heat. Now all I'm doing is actually infusing the flavor into the oil. I don't want it to overpower the dish. So please bear with me. It's not the typical anguamo that I'm making where I actually fry the onions till it's browned. Once it's perfectly fried, discard majority of the hot water from the rice and I'm left with about 100 milliliters of water and I'm going to add the rice to my oiled mixture. Now I'm just going to fry this gently and mix everything together and this is where the infusion takes place. Now add your salt to taste and I've actually used pink salt here but you can use your sea salt or whatever salt you have available. I had my pink salt available hence I used it but I thought it was actually quite nice actually for this dish. Maybe you should try it and you might like it. Mix everything together and fry gently for about two minutes and now you can add your coconut milk. Mix the rice and coconut milk together till it's well combined and now it's ready to actually steam and for those flavors to infuse into this dish. Now this is actually going to cook quicker, reason being we've actually parboiled the rice so cover it with this lid. You should I even say use a greaseproof paper, you don't even need it now. All I've just done is just put on a very low heat and steamed it for 10 minutes and voila I do have my fluffy rice. My next recipe actually involves this rice while well, actually be making the fried rice because a lot of people have actually asked me for it. And of course, I'm actually going to be making my fried rice with my own little twist. You do not want to miss that. Have you subscribed yet? If you do like this video, click on that subscribe button, show me some love, try the recipe, leave a comment. It's in Dudubai Fafa. Thank you again for watching.